welcome to Berwick Mitsubishi. My name's Stephen, and today I'm going to do a walk around video presentation for you of this fantastic 2015 Toyota Hilux SR5. As you can see from the front here, it's the new style, a little bit pointier nose than the old flat nose uh, Hiluxes that you're used to seeing here. A lot of chroma through the front here with our big Toyota badge. Coming across here, you see we've got our daytime running lights at the top of our headlights there. Nicely styled headlights with the fog lamps down below. Now, part of the video today, we go through the paint condition and the paintwork for you too. And you can see the overall condition across the bonnet is fairly good. A couple of minor little chips on there. And then when we look across the front of the bumper bar here, we've got a couple of minor stone chips around the front of the bumper as well. Coming around to the driver's guard now, you'll see nicely styled, nice paintwork too with that sparkle through the uh, paint in the sun. You can see here we've got our nice Hilux in our headlights on the side of the there. Looking down at our alloy rims, really good condition there with fantastic tread tyres on there. Not going to have to worry about buying tyres for the front of this car anytime soon. You can see now we get to our driver's door here, we've got our Hilux badging with our 2.8 lead up D or 4D badging. Our chrome mirror with our indicator integrated in there too, as well as having our chrome door handles being the SR5. Keyless entry too, which is why we've got our little button there. Having a look at our windows there, you can see they do look like they've been tinted on the front too, which is really good. Our black side steps along the bottom there, and the condition of the paintwork on the doors, it, overall condition is very, very good. Now as we come further along, We'll start at the back wheel here, looking at the rim, really good condition there. Once again, got good tyres on the back of the uh, Hilux as well. And looking at the condition of the paintwork on the side of the tub here, really good condition that I, from what I can see. Looking up from there, you do have our colour-coded uh, hard lid there with our nice chrome sports bars there. Really nicely styled with the sleek layback design there. And then coming around to the back of the car, Straight away you'll see we've got our big tail lights there, our Hilux SR5 badge with our big chrome handle in the back of the tailgate, which also nicely hides away the reverse camera. We have our high mount stop lamp as well as being able to open our hardwood nice and easy with one handle there. Lifting it up, we've got our gas struts there. In the back you will notice, <coughs> excuse me, you will notice we've got our roof racks here, rubber floor mats, and our tow bar tongue there. So also having our genuine tub liner in the back here, really, really nicely looked after. We've got a little light up on the hard lid there too. Easy to pull down one-handed there. And then as we step back, you'll see our nice chrome rear step tow bar, uh, sorry, yeah, rear step, as well as our tow bar there. Now giving us a very good towing capacity of 3.2 tonne braked. So really good being able to tow plenty of weight there. And coming around to the passenger side now, having a look at the tub here, really good condition from what I can see. Might be just, no, nope, a little bit rubbed off. So overall condition, really, really good here. Looking at the back alloy rim and tyre, fantastic condition as well. And then as we come along the, <coughs> excuse me, the left-hand side here, looking at the doors, the overall condition, a couple of minor little marks just here. But overall, really, really good condition, uh, as we can see. Once again, our chrome mirror with the indicator in the side, so nicely styled there. And then coming down, looking at our front guard here, overall condition, really, really good. Looking at the front rim there, once again, fantastic condition and excellent tyres there for you. Now, as we come back around to the front here, I'll pop the bonnet and I'll show you we do have our four-cylinder 2.8 litre turbo diesel engine. <coughs> Excuse me. Now this is going to produce around 130 kilowatts of power, which is quite a good amount of power in these. And I believe it's around 450, uh, that is correct, 450 newton metres of torque. Now that's where all your towing capacity comes from. Uh, having a look here, we've also got this, it's also coupled with the six speed automatic transmission. 4x4 four four as well. So that's going to give us an impressive 8.5 litres per 100 kilometres as our fuel average. So out of the 80 litre tank, that is around 941 kilometres of driving. All right, now to the inside of our Hilux here. 
I'm going to start on the right hand side for you. Start looking at our window controls here, all automatic up and down, which is really nice. We have our window lock button, door lock button, and our mirror controls there too. Now the ability to uh, flick the switch there so you can actually fold them in when you need to as well so that's a really handy thing to be able to do having a look down here you can see we've got our push button start up from there you've got your auto headlights there as well as having your little fog lamp switch on the front and your indicators and high beams on the right hand stalk on the left hand side stalk here you'll have your front wiper controls which is really good and then having a look at our steering wheel, really nicely styled here, nice and comfortable to hold on, leather wrapped, with cruise control underneath. On the right hand side here we've got our menu controls for our display in the centre of the screen here. So you can go through, you can bring up your compass, your music, or whatever you want to have up there. And on the left hand side we do have our volume control, our skip buttons, as well as underneath we've got your phone answer and hang up button there. So really nice and easy to use. Coming across from there, looking at our dash, nicely styled there. We've got our little clock at the top with our hazard light button. And then coming down, you'll notice our nice big touchscreen command unit there too. Which, while we're looking at that, doubles as our reverse camera. So popping it into reverse, you can see here, nice and easy to back up towards the wall. Giving you plenty of room behind. And that's going to leave you roughly 300mm in front of the wall. So really good there. The good thing there is you can have your radio readout on the left hand side, you can also have your maps up on the right hand side. So there you can go to your apps here, brings your navigation, your audio, your phone and your setup. So really nice and easy to use there. Down below you've got your climate control which is nice and easy to use too. On there with your fan dial and your temperature uh, change there. Your main controls to go through your vents and everything are there. Down below you have your rear diff lock, downhill descent and your traction stability control. And on the right hand side we've got our four wheel drive switch there too. So really nice and easy. 12 volt charge point on the left hand side here. And we've got our USB and auxiliary port tucked away behind a nice little rubber flap there. So it keeps it out of the way. Now you'll see we've got our nice big cup holders and in front there we've got a bit of a phone holder or a change holder. Looking at our automatic transmission shifter there, really nice and easy to use. We can pop it into drive, we can go sport, and then if we move the stick, drive it as a manual in the Tiptronic mode. Another little storage compartment there, and popping open the centre console here, you'll see we've got a, it's a little bit different here, you can actually see that it's a 100 watt power point, so not a 12 volt charge socket, so if you're getting really tired, you can try and stick your finger in there just to give you a bit of a wake up on those long nights. Now as we have a look around the car, you'll see the overall condition inside really, really nice as well. The carpets have been well looked after with our rubber mats. The seat here, fantastic condition. And as we look around there, same around the car too, inside. A couple of little marks on the roof um, from guys getting in and out. Uh, but overall condition, really, really good condition. And the service history is the same here. So you can see all uh, service through uh, Berwick Toyota, uh, sorry, Toyota I believe. So you got the first one at Berwick Toyota, uh, Warrigal Toyota, Berwick again, Warrigal. So they've sort of alternated back and forth, but that was the up to the 40 there. You got the 50,000 service, the 60, the 70,000. And we've done an intermediate service when we got the vehicle at 83,000. So fantastic service history on this car, and you won't have to worry about spending any money on it anytime soon. Alright, so that's our walk around video for you today of this fantastic 2015 Toyota Hilux SR5. Now as you can see, the overall condition of the car really, really well looked after. Uh, great fuel economy, we've got the lockable hard lid on there and full service history on the car too. So if you've got any questions about the vehicle, please give us a call here at Berwick Mitsubishi on 9907 555 and thanks for watching.